Check, one, two. Who's Mike's doing that? We painted a quote on our local art wall that's just around the corner as you come into the Skipper Dome area for a show. The best people in the world walk through our doors. And we believe that with everything we have in us, um, from staff to customers, it's a really good thing we have going here and we wanted to keep it going. <laughs> It's just a really nice atmosphere once everyone is here and gathers and that's what makes it special, you know, the presence of the people and that love that they bring. That's why Skipper is here in the middle of Tampa. It's so important to everyone that comes here because we're all familiar with it and this is our gathering point. Because of the coronavirus, you know, a lot of business has suffered making it through. Skippers is one of those affected by these business decisions and, you know, all that fun can be taken away. And so if you peel back the layer of the onion on why we had to close and what was driving that, certainly COVID was number one, right? That was the primary driving force of us having to close the doors. The restrictions were just such that it just didn't create a scenario with who we are and what we do that was viable. Tom White has been here for 40 years, and so he thought, well, maybe this is my time to just say, okay, I'm gonna go fishing. You know, after 40 years of business here in Tampa, you gotta imagine a lot of the loyal customers here at Skipper Smokehouse, well, they are multi-generational, and all through the night, we've watched as so many patrons have stopped to take one final picture in front of the iconic tie-dye sign. As long as I can remember, my family has brought me here. It was like a piece of all of us kind of just went missing a little bit. I was trying to sell the place. We had several groups come forward. We got close, but ultimately just couldn't do it. Then it was time to figure out, okay, well, if we can't seem to get that done, what next? This old girl can't sit here. She's got too much soul, you know? She's got that vibe, she's got that soul, and the whole world needs to enjoy it. The place got a vibe. It's just got that thing that people like. People here, they come for the music. They love the music. So places like this, I enjoy it as much as I do if it was at Madison Square Garden, and I played there a few times. We started working to assemble a team to reopen. I decided to lead the way. I did not think they were gonna open back up. So when they called me back, I pretty much dropped everything and ran back here. scenario of her sitting here and nobody getting to enjoy her and me knowing how much everybody loves her and how much I love her. It was time for me to try to pull myself up by the bootstraps and, and dive in head first and admittedly into stuff that I've never done. Some of this is very new to me as well. Our community and our staff that wanted to return, that's why we're here, that's why we came back. It's not a cakewalk, but we're doing it because we love it and we believe in it. Things might change, who knows? Everything is so uncertain nowadays that you really can't tell, but I hope they work it out. I hope uh, they all tie the knots down. Live music is all I know. That's what I've been doing since 13. The only way to keep it alive is we gotta keep it alive and keep playing, keep playing, and keep playing. Yeah, how's everybody doing tonight? Yeah. Senior, skip a smoke house. Yeah, it's been a while since we've been back, but I'm glad that who showed up showed up. We want to start with a little bit of funk. If you want to funk, make some noise. 
Music is music and live is extra special because whatever band it is, they're performing for you that night. I think it just comes back to having respect and love and care and you just want to be together, you know? And now we can again, which is huge. Those of you who are instilling your trust and your faith in us upon our reopening, it means everything to us. We just ask that everybody is just a little more understanding. You've chosen to spend your hard-earned money here. You deserve a great experience. And that's not lost on us and we're giving it all we've got. And we'll continue to do so.